on relationship matter. See, let me tell you. Any relationship you start at the beginning is always very blossome and it looks like this is heaven and earth. It is always like that. Because if it is not like that, you are not going to start it. So it's always like that. But as time goes on, you begin to see a whole lot of different dimension of things that you never dream of, you never thought of. But when it happens like that, never ever you consider killing your spouse your boyfriend don't ever intend to kill because if you kill it means you are not wise a living spouse that is separated from you has some benefits to you especially when you have children but the dead one has no benefit at all see it this way if you are married and you have children and the man begins to hate you and you separate from the man, let me tell you, my dear, if you know yourself, that will be the beginning of your enjoyment. The Nigerian court, they are not as wicked as we are thinking. Hmm? They are not as wicked as you are thinking. If you take the matter to the court, there will be a provision for your children. Then, if you don't want to go to court, if you go to welfare, there is an organization they call Welfare now. Go there. You will notice that this is the beginning of your, should I say, I cannot really call it enjoyment, but just imagine you are living with a man. He does not care whether you eat. He does not care where has strength come from. He does not care where the children, how the children are surviving. But by the time you separate yourself from him, then you go to either welfare or the Nigerian court. They will now make it compulsory for him to provide. So you will not see that. Now that you separate yourself, your life is better than when you were inside. When you were inside, he does not care about your survivor and the survivor of the children. But by the time you separate yourself and you bring in the, 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 the law enforcement agent, he will begin to supply it may not really be 100% enough, but at least it's still better than when you were inside his house. You suffer for rent, school fees, everything. He does not give you one neither. Rather, he will even be collecting from you. Take your money, go and give to side chick, and you'll be crying every night. When you separate yourself from this kind of spouse, whatever he's sending, if you like, make it send 20,000. If you like, make it send 50,000. We know in the current Nigeria economy, it's never enough to take care of the children but it is still better than when he was not sending anything to you when you were in the house it is still better than when you managed to do your small small business he collect this money from you for by force it is still better than when your life is at risk with the level of hatred that he has for you maybe beating you quarreling with you there is every possibility that this person can kill you at night or poison your food or do anything so when you separate yourself you, you are out of that risk of dying at any time. And again, you now have the benefit of getting something to assist the children. As in, your load is a bit relief. Your load is a bit relief. Another benefit again is when you separate yourself, it means you are alive. You can still date somebody or get married to somebody. And this person will also be assisting you. So you see, you are not having... Possibly three sources of income. The one that said you are not good, he maltreated you, he's sending. The current person that loves you now, he's sending, he's giving. Then whatever business or job you are doing, you are still getting money from them. You now have three. Okay? Three sources of income. You see? So those people that get angry and kill their spouse, or maybe they kill themselves, these people are not wise. A wise woman. When she has done all she can do, you finish crying, you finish complaining, you finish praying. The next thing is to separate. And that will be the beginning of your glory.